About 1,100 dioceses around the world are supported by the organization, the Pontifical Mission Societies. Across Latin America, Asia, Africa, and the Middle East, missionaries serve in areas where the Catholic Church is poor, persecuted, or young. And there's an important challenge to going away from that place where I'm comfortable to serve those whom I don't know uh, in a disinterested way. This is at the heart of a service which is a disinterested service purely of love and giving of myself to others. And that's why it's important to value the work of the missionaries. Each third Sunday in October, Catholic churches around the world collect a special offering to support these Christian communities and missionaries. And Father Harrington says that while the organization's goal is not solely the collection, each little donation counts. Every year, every diocese, which is a mission diocese, receives what's called an ordinary subsidy, about $30,000. And let me just tell you, you know, people in the United States would think, well, what does 30000 really do? I just came back from Ethiopia. In Ethiopia, uh, with $10,000, $10,000, uh, we are able to pay the salaries of priests in two dioceses for four months. This is just simply the mass stipends that are coming from the United States. So 30,000 is critical to the running of a diocese. But gathering funds to support missionaries in these dioceses in every corner of the world isn't always easy. In the United States, collection 30 years ago was with the equivalent of $88 million. And last year was 23 million. Uh, that drop off has a significant effect uh, in the mission territories. 30 years ago, the United States was not as rich as it is now. Most people are not as well off 30 years ago as they are today. Uh, and yet, uh, the, the collection has really fallen off dramatically. Yet Father Harrington says he hopes that by inspiring a greater love for the missions, the organization can raise the necessary funds to serve the thousands of people in mission dioceses.